All right, so today we're going to be reviewing this three-in-one air duster and vacuum cleaner. It can blow air and vacuum. So this is the Amazon Azin. On the left side, it says multiple filtering, cyclone suction, USB charging, a three-in-one multifunction, detachable wash, HIPAA filter. All right, let's open it. And here is the vacuum cleaner. The main unit is on the right and the vacuum part is on the left. And uh, we have a power button right here. It's pretty easy. Click on, click off. Uh, the bottom has the, the charging port. Okay, let's see what else we have. Okay, we have this charging cable with USB plug and the power side goes to the bottom of the unit. Okay, when you plug the USB in, there's a light that turns green. Plug in the power to the unit. It shows the red light indicating it is charging. Pretty cool. And while it's plugged in, you can actually still use it. Okay, what is next? All right, we have this tube. Okay, we have this piece. Okay, this piece can fit here. Alright, it sucks. And we have the brush that goes to the front of the tip. Pretty cool. Alright, and we have this piece. Okay, these two pieces seems like they are for inflatable items. And we have the brush for the air duster part. Okay, here's the manual. So there are three different functions we can use. Okay, it shows you how to put it together. All right, let's try out the vacuum. All right, let's plug it in. And again, twist. Pretty easy, looks like. I'm going to take the brush off. And let's go. Wow, you see all the dust and hair right inside. Looks like we have collected so much trash. Let's take the filter out. Whoa, we got a lot of trash. All right, next we're going to do the vacuum sealer. So we have this piece. And then we have the other piece. So it is time to test. But what should I test? Okay, boys, I got this inflatable air mattress just for this video. Alright, let's put it out. Let's face the air in part to the bottom. And I have a timer right here. Let's see how long it will take to inflate this air mattress. Let's put the insert at the end. And let's start. All right, that looks good. Let's turn it off. And the time is about 1 minute and 30 seconds. Oh, yes. This feels pretty good. Oh, I got it upside down. So here's the right part. Let me jump on it again. Oh, yes. Feels good. Time to test the other side. And we're going to put it back to the front for suction. You guys ready? Let's go. Alright, looks like the unit has ran out of battery and the time is about the same, 1 minute and 30 seconds. Looks like the unit has ran out of battery. Alright, let's fold it back. Okay, and finally we're going to try the air duster. Alright, let's put the thing at the blowing air side and we're gonna use the brush also. Alright, looks like it's blowing pretty good. And here I have a computer that I need to clean. It has been more than two years since I cleaned it actually. And uh, there is a lot of dust starting on the top, on the outside surface, on the back, near the fans, and also the inside. So let me take that out. And in the inside, we have so much dust as well. And from this side, we can also take out our glass. So much dust on the fan, on the board, on this board, and pretty much everywhere with air float. Alright, let's go! So we are blowing the air at the unit, and we are also using a brush to dust off anything that is stuck on the surface. Oh man, that is a lot of dust. Oh boy, would you look at that. So much dust. And this is my display card. So much dust on it. After about 10 minutes, I finally cleaned the whole thing. 
Let's turn it back on. Oh boy, it is looking good and clean. Alright, so that is pretty much about it. Let's do a quick recap. On the black side, it is air in and the red side is air out. I think the unit design can be a little bit better. The air dust part is pretty easy to come out. Like whenever I hit something, it will just come out. And I have to put my hand over the tube to keep it in place. And I really wish that it could have a better design. The functionality is pretty good. Uh, but the overall, with the design, I'm gonna give it 4 out of 5. So that is pretty much it. Thank you so much for watching. If you think you would like this, I'm gonna leave the link down below. So thank you so much for watching. If you like this video, make sure to hit the like button. Hit subscribe button if you want to see me again comment down below if you want to tell me anything and i will see you in the next video Shh.